sport management isn't just business, it's life. And you look for opportunities that hopefully will take you wherever you want to go. One thing that really surprised me about sport management was the chaos behind the scenes. We turn on the television or we walk in the front gate at the stadium and everything looks so perfect and you don't realise what's had to take place to actually make that moment happen. I think sport management as an industry is very progressive. It's still learning. It's why we still see mistakes being made at the elite level, at the community level. There is so much to talk about, so much to unpack, so much to discuss with students. I think the unique thing about being in my class is that I've been there before. I'm really interested in bringing local or recent examples to the class. I think our students leave Torrens University well prepared for the sports industry. We very much focus on the managing of athletes and teams. We explore marketing, explore uh, some of the governance and integrity issues in sport. So it's a diverse mix, uh, it's contemporary, and it prepares the students for the sports industry today. I'm still connected to the sport industry today. I recently returned to my local football club as secretary. I'm also studying my PhD, exploring uh, the corporate social responsibility at professional sports teams. Now, I think the people that really excel at sport management have a couple of qualities. Uh, firstly, they, they love people. I think people in sport tend to be all-rounders. They think on their feet, and they can react and make decisions really quickly. One of the great experiences I've had in sport was attending the 2000 Olympics in Sydney. I volunteered for the Paralympics, saw some amazing Paralympians. And I wish I'd discovered that earlier because I would have volunteered and travelled to a number of other sporting events and I really encourage students to embrace those opportunities. My advice to anybody wanting to work in the sport industry is to really embrace it. You do need the qualification, you do need the industry experience. Put yourself out there, really position yourself for casual or full-time employment towards the end of the degree. Don't wait to graduate, get an early start.